Okay, this is a quick video demonstrating our post-processing. This is a custom SMARS wheel and custom SMARS track. We notice that through no fault of the design, the inside of the wheel, because of where the extruder lets off, often has imperfections. I don't know if you can see that in there. Just from little wispy parts of the plastic in the extruder. So what we came up with is a 3D printed matching piece that goes into the wheel. We coat the inside with a little bit of Vaseline to keep it from seizing and then we basically spin it a whole bunch and it smooths it off and then previously this was not spinning under the power of this weak stepper motor but after spinning it with this tool that we 3D printed it works fine. So my stepson is going to demonstrate how we post process here. So what's going on here is just the friction of wearing out like that smooths everything out and it acts as kind of its own sandpaper, I guess. And then when that's done, this very tiny stepper motor is able to spin the wheel where it was not before. So presumably the gear motor and everything else would have equal success.